We welcome you back to Minute Maid Park, and it is time to introduce to you the progressive fan of the game. I have a special guest, Ron Brand, with me, a catcher for the Astros in 1965. Have we taken you back? Do you feel like it was just yesterday that was 1965? Absolutely. I'm looking down on the field, and it's it's like being born again and, and being in this atmosphere. It was a great privilege to be in part of that uh, experience, and uh, it's wonderful to be back here and see my old teammates and uh, get that Astro feeling again. Well, you were a catcher then for the Astros, and you were in the lineup for that first exhibition game against the Yankees. What do you remember about that game? I, there's a special moment I want you to share with us. I remember I was scared to death, and uh, when I went up to the plate my first time, I just said a little prayer, please don't let me make a fool of myself. And it worked out. Well, you did it. Tell us about the hit. Well, uh, as luck would have it, the very first pitch was Mel Stottlemyer for the Yankees right down the middle, and the umpire said, ball one. And that somehow made me relax. And he threw the next pitch, and I lined it into right center. It went off the wall for a triple. And I always thought I could have scored, but the coach held me up, so I had to stop at third. Well, the first Astro to get a hit there at the Astrodome. That has to be special, right? Yes, it was one of the highlights of my career because when I they, it was the bottom of the third inning, and when I rounded first, the roar that went up from 55,000 people who had been waiting for something to happen, uh, it was such a thrill. And I think I ran faster from first to third than I ever ran in my life. Well, just seeing, you've been in baseball a scout for the Yankees for many years, but just seeing what the Astros and the Astrodome did for the city of Houston. Well, I think it put, put it on the map as far as baseball was concerned because it was the eighth wonder of the world. It was a magnificent structure. It had its flaws, of course, but it still allowed people to come into an environment where they could watch a baseball game and be comfortable. And the old Buffalo Stadium was torture to be in the summertime out there. I hear about the mosquitoes too. Thank you so much. Ron Brandt, first Astro to collect a hit at the Astrodome. Full cool stuff. Thanks for the memories. Thank you very much. Guys, over to you. Thanks, Julia. Two balls and a strike.